Hello, wonderful singers, and welcome to your Covo vocal exercise of the week. I'm Dr. Julia Nielsen, founder of Covo, which is short for Community Vocalizing, where our mission is to advance singers' vocal health, fitness, and longevity by providing creative vocal exercise routines. And this winter, Covo is offering a very special series of creative vocal exercise routines called Messiah Agility. During this series of three workouts, we are focusing on the fast passages from four major choruses found in Handel's famous choral masterwork, The Messiah. In other words, we're working on the agility skills that a singer needs in order to sing the Messiah. Well, get it? Messiah agility, Messiah agility. During each workout, we are learning the iconic recurring melodic themes from each chorus. We are learning how to cleanly and accurately articulate these passages without using H's. <laughs> And we're learning how to increase the speed at which one can sing these passages. During these workouts, I also demonstrate how a challenging passage from a singer's repertoire can be used as a vocal exercise, which is a fantastic time-saving way to kill two birds with one stone. Our vocal exercise of the week is exactly this, a short passage from one of the choruses from the Messiah, which happens to contain two common Baroque agility patterns that every singer should practice. Taken out of its context, this excerpt makes a fantastic vocal exercise. It comes from the chorus, All We Like Sheep, and if you have ever sung this chorus, you probably remember that the next words are have gone astray, which unfortunately is what happens to many singers as they get to this agile part of this chorus. Now the passage here contains two patterns. A descending three tone scale that jumps back up a third and an ascending three-tone scale that jumps back down a third. In our Messiah Agility workouts, we practice each of these patterns, we call them agility blocks, in isolation. For example, we might sing a string of the descending three-tone scales, uh, the ones that then jump back up a third. So look at the top line here. is the same. Down three steps, jump back up a third. Try singing the top line with me on a vowel of your choice. I'm going to use the E vowel. Here we go, nice and slow. short exercise containing just the ascending three tone scales, the ones which then jump back down a third, look at the bottom line. Try singing the bottom line with me, and again, you may use a vowel of your choice, nice and slow. Let's do it up a half step. 
two patterns in the excerpt from the Messiah. Let's try this slowly using the words from the piece. We have turned, or in this case, turned, because of the way that the syllables are split. So we're here in this key. We start here. Here we go about this fast. Here we go. And one. We have turned. is very difficult to sing at that speed in one breath but we'll try it again here we go and one we have turned. let's try that one more time is it settling in a tiny bit faster here we go this as a vocal exercise, we will simply transpose it up and down by half steps according to our voice category. Let's try it in the next key. Here we go. One. We have mentioned since we are on the syllable turn uh, for a while here it is uh, worth thinking about the fact that even though this is what's called an R colored vowel er, we don't want a tight and narrow tongue while singing it er, we have tur mm, we have turned so let's try a few more here we go and one Uh, and it's a little easier, isn't it? How about lower in pitch for the altos and basses? We have turned. We have turned. How about one more? and easier. Let's try it one last time in our original key a little faster. So I invite you to play with this excerpt in the coming week. It's such a great exercise, isn't it? And also think about passages from your current repertoire that you could transform into vocal exercises. If you enjoyed this Messiah Agility exercise, our series of three 45-minute Messiah Agility workouts is now available for registration on our website, kobo.com, and instructions on how to join us are in the description below. Kovo also provides twice weekly general vocal workouts. These are live, and if you are not already joining us, we'd love to have you. These sessions are 
absolutely free. We meet on Zoom every Monday and Wednesday from 6 to 6.30 p.m. Pacific time and instructions on how to request our free Zoom link are in the description below. And finally, singers, remember, regular vocal exercise is crucial for your vocal health, fitness, and longevity. Every time you show up at Covo, you're going to get a creative vocal workout, expert coaching, and a community of friends to practice with. We'll see you there.